If you're looking for a new lunch spot, a relaxing area, or a place to bring the kids, the newly renovated Ballast Point Park is the place to be. Located at the end of Bayshore Boulevard, Ballast Point is pleased to announce the grand reopening of its park. Mayor Bob Buckhorn was there to celebrate and show his pride in this project. Well, it's all, all about quality of life, and, you know, and to have parks like this where our kids can come and play, where they can enjoy the water halls and the, and the tot lots and the slides, I mean, it really enhances their life. And so the more of these that we can do, the better that we are as a city. The community of Ballast Point raised funds for a tot lot, a playground for children ages 5 and under. The city of Tampa then matched those funds to complete the project as an addition to the existing playground for older kids. Well, public-private partnerships is the way for parks and recreation in the future. Obviously, police and fire and schools have to be funded, and parks sometimes we don't have as many uh, nickels to rub together. And so when the public steps up and helps us fund a project like we have here, it's just fantastic. The results are obvious. More changes include the great green circular lawn and new picnic shelters, benches, and grills for those summer barbecues. With the help of some neighborhood friends, Mayor Buckhorn started up the splash pad, the most popular new feature to the park. With fountains and overhead buckets of water, the kids will certainly have a blast while cooling off at the same time. They like the water features for sure. Uh, I mean, it's a big park, it's got a lot of space, it's got a lot of activities. We've got new grills, we've got new shelters. But if you ask any kid, and I have two of them, They'll take the splash pads any day of the week. They want to get in the fountains, they want to get wet, they want to have a good time, they want to push their little brothers or sisters under the water. Um, it's, it's cool. And if I was a kid, I'd be here every day. Oh, we love Ballast Point Park. We are so excited about all the new changes, the whole tot lot section, the infant swings, and the most important is the splash zone. We love it. It's so much fun. Ballast Point Park isn't just for the kids. Anyone can enjoy the long fishing pier or boat ramp with a great view of the city's skyline. So we love going down the pier to watch the dolphins swim and, you know, occasionally we'll bring out the fishing poles and the worms and try to catch some fish. Right next to the pier is the restaurant Taste of Boston, bringing New England seafood to Tampa. Attached is a bait shop where you can stock up on worms and other fishing supplies. The park originally opened in 1894 and was named Jules Verne Park, but people today are still enjoying what it has to offer. Well, I think what we're doing is not only keeping green space in a highly developed area, but we're adding amenities to it, we're updating it, uh, we're adding new technology. I mean, it's not just swings anymore, it's interactive, it's water features, it's uh, handicap accessible. I mean, it's got all the features of a modern day park. I'm excited about it. I know the neighbors are really, really excited about it. You can tell from the look on these little kids that they're going to love this. They are absolutely going to love this. Ballast Point Park is a fun place for kids of all ages, even big ones like me. I know where I'm going on the next hot day. For Spotlight Tampa, I'm Caroline Mattel.